Welcome back from the hell of the jungle, Stanley. Did we you... had a great break, didn't we? Terrific, just absolutely <laughs> wonderful time. Is it, was it better or, or worse than you feared or imagined? It was much better, much better. I mean, honestly, I, I, I dare I say so, I enjoyed it. I mean, nothing to do. You could just sit around waiting for more mm. rice and beans. Mm. And then occasional breaks when you did what's called a bush tucker trial or the dingo It's dollar. a bit like being foreign secretary, really, right? Uh, well, it's a bit like being back, <laughs> <laughs> a bit like, a bit like being back at school, actually, with a, <laughs> with a whole lot of friends you didn't know. Mm. But you got to, you got to know them. No, it was great fun. And for me, you know, as an environmentalist, I really like being in the jungle. Mm. But by the way, a wonderful part of Australia. And just fantastic. What the reality of being in that jungle how, how tough is it in terms of the environment you're actually existing well in? the tough part of it is you're only getting about 600 calories a day and I've actually lost some weight you've noticed that Do they? You've, you've, never you, you've lost some weight I have yeah. we're well, both good. lean machines yeah lean machine yeah. lean green machines yeah. okay 600 <laughs> calories a day so the name of the game is to supplement that 600 calories a day which mm. is li no, small small mm. by winning some trials and that's why it's actually a very well devised show because you actually have to go out there and do this eating of the witchly grubs or, or being surrounded by animals of various kinds actually it's been environmentalist i really liked it and when i sat there with a mask on my head and you know hermit crabs surrounding me and getting in my ears and so on. I thought, well, you know, up close and personal. Nothing Why new not? for a Johnson, though, is it? That kind of behaviour. <laughs> 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 <I mean>, creepy <laughs> things crawling all over you. Come Did on. you, when, the minute that you met Toff, I mean, she was sort of in awe of you, uh, clearly, you know, a little bit of soft spot. I don't but think did anybody's you, ever been in awe of But me. did you <laughs> spot that she was the winner? I spotted Toff. I was spot on. I mean, I said, Toff is tough. You know, when, mm. the, when, you know, when the when the tough gets going, tough gets going, and so on. Yeah. And I was clear she was going to win. That said, that said, you know, I wasn't going to walk away, and I was perfectly happy to do challenges and things, even when, you know, she was in there bound to, bound to get there. Yeah. You're a very nice chap, Stanley, but if I really pinned you down on this, which of them would you least want to be trapped on a desert island with the rest of your natural life? Ho, ho, ho. Now, this is a very, very nasty question yeah. uh, 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 to ask. Well... Basically, the chap I really, really enjoyed was uh, Amir. Amir. You liked Amir. You liked sparring I, I like with him, didn't I mean, you? That's a, that's a nice one. What, who's the one you least enjoyed? I'm serious. I mean, okay. one of them. You must have had someone you didn't like. Well, I tell you something. There was a very complex figure there, and that was that was Ian. Yeah. He's a very complex man, and insofar as I like a simple life, if I was trapped on a desert island, I'm not sure I would want to be trapped with a complex oh, character. I know what you mean. I know I what mean, you that mean. It? Well, you're, you're in good company here, then. Yeah. Yeah. We're as deep as a puddle here. Oh. You'll be yeah. all right, Stan. Oh, what do you think about Richard? I have to say... I'm not going to, but someone like Richard Stanley, would do me Stanley. fine. He'd be, he'd he'd be useful in the jungle. Richard would be super. Ian had a tough time, though, in the did jungle. He? Yeah. Why? Well, I think that, you what know... What time did he have that he didn't think he'd get by entering the jungle? I mean, seriously. I, I stood up for him a couple yeah. of times when he'd been on some gantry, you know, above a deep enchanted chasm and he hadn't wanted to walk in and said we didn't get the points that day. I stood up for him. Yeah, and, and he was very, very popular. But he's been moaning years. about Becky Vardy. She was just, you know, playing, trying to play the win. That's all uh, point of a damn thing. Way, if you enter a jungle no, reality honestly, show... I totally agree with you. Um, Piers, I've got to say, Becky yeah. and Dennis, wonderful. You know, I was privileged. Do you know something? We all think celebrities are people who wander around Westminster and Lazarus. These were real celebrities. Dennis, mm. Dennis played 21 times for mm. England. Exactly. For heaven's sake. We've lost the ashes. You're a cricket man. Mm. I was there. I, I was actually You were in, out there. The moment in, you came back from Australia, it all went horribly wrong. Well, we got to the fifth day. Yeah. The fifth day of the third test. But diamond free, three love down. You can't have a, you know, a worse, worse loss Is there anything that. worse than losing to Australians in cricket, in your experience? Um, well, I think there is. I think... You know, having nothing to do for three weeks in the jungle. <laughs> <laughs> I came out, I rather, ga rather made a sort of a gaff. I said, this is a bit of a rip bang I said, is Boris still Prime Minister? What I On our programme, yeah. live the morning and after, what I wanted yeah. to say, of course, is Boris still... Well, he sent me a lovely, lovely message saying he thought on the whole, Brand Johnson had, you know, gone and gone up. And actually, I've been reading the Sunday newspaper, this lovely lady, Toff, yeah. she wanted, she said she lovely things about me. Well, she oh, loves you and she well, thinks I, that Jacob Rees-Mogg is a sex god. Well, he certainly is. I mean, can you imagine? Obviously, there's a, obviously there's a thing for these older men. Stanley. Well, she is kind enough to say I was, I was on the upper limit of middle age. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs>